Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to another episode of Gamecocks Talk with Captain Will. I am your boy. I'm your boy, Captain Will. Make sure you like, make sure you sh- make sure you subscribe, make sure you share, make sure you tell a friend, tell everybody that your boy, Captain Will, your boy, Captain Will is live and in color. It is on, it is on, it is on. And oh, 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 oh. oh. Somebody told me there was a game tonight. Somebody told me there was a game tonight. I, I, I don't know who it was that told me that there was a basketball game tonight. It was a basketball game tonight, and um, and and, and I was invited. I was invited, but but I guess that my invitation got lost in the mail. So so my invitation got lost in the mail. So so I decided to 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 dress like how they did tonight. I decided to dress like oh those LSU Tigers did tonight. Oh, so I had my little my, my feather boa going on. I had my t-shirt. I I because I because I made a bet. I made a bet uh with some of the uh, uh, uh LSU fans that if if, if 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 LSU beat South Carolina, then I would wear a t-shirt and I wear a boa. So 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 I decided I didn't want to let it go to waste. So, you know, so so Amazon, you know, I I decided to, to put on the boa. You know what I'm saying? Put on the boa to see how I feel to see what all the hoopla is all about how do i feel wait this is how i feel i don't give a damn about no lsu we won the game i ain't wearing no t-shirt how you like me now oh my god oh we gonna have a good one tonight y'all we gonna have a good one tonight y'all and it is shot o'clock it is shot o'clock tonight so, so I know y'all been getting ready. I know for this day, for this bright and early day, for this uh, uh, Christmas day right now, you are ready for it. You ready for it. So, so, so we got to go ahead and get this old, old shot together. And we're going to do some Tito's because Tito's is an old favorite of mine. Tito's old favorite of mine. So we're doing a shot. And it got to start with a Gamecock shot glass. Got to start with a Gamecock shot glass. So, so in honor of this uh, uh, beating of LSU in that old PMAC uh, uh, stadium arena where there's a whiteout. They had a whiteout. They were tailgating all damn day. They were doing all this stuff. Shots up. Shots up. Mm-hmm. But that ain't it. Before we start partaking in some festivities and starting this party tonight, before we start talking about this party tonight and talk about the game and all these different things, we gotta we gotta do a little appetizer. We gotta do a little appetizer. So 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 we gotta do a little appetizer, and and, and you can't do an appetizer without some old sweet tea. So for all your LSU fans who might chime in today, might be chiming in with your boy tonight. We got some sweet tea in this second. Those old sweet. I'm talking about that sweet tea, that sweet tea to give you diabetes. I'm talking about that sweet tea where you got to add water to it. I'm talking about that sweet tea that you just been brewing for a long time. And I've been waiting for this sweet tea. I've been waiting. So we got the sweet tea. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh. That's a sweet tea right there. My wife put her foot in that joint right there. Ooh. So when you got your sweet tea, we got your sweet tea. Well, well, well. That's an appetizer. That's an appetizer, sweet tea. Mm-hmm. We got the sweet tea, sweet tea. That's the appetizer. So, so you know what goes with the appetizer. So you got to need a main course, right? You need a main course. So, so cause the main course got to be some old, some old pig feet. So what you have right here is a del- a delicatessen of of goodness, of goodness, some sweet tea. This is country folk right here. This is country folk right here. This is how we do it in the country. This is how we do it in the country. This is how we do it. This is what we do in the country. We get some old pig feet. We get some old sweet tea. And we talk junk. That's what we do. So that's what OK and we were going to do tonight. I mean, some pig feet. I mean, some sweet tea. And I'm going to talk junk half the damn night. And I'm going to be so nice tonight. So nice tonight. So let's take a little bite. We're going to take a little bite. If all the northerners or midwesterns Swesson is watching right now. My homeboy from Hawaii watching right now. I just want you to just, 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 just look at it. And it's, it's real red, real red. But uh, well, we're going to take a, take, a, take a bite of it. Let's go take a bite. Mm-hmm. Take a, ooh. 
some sweet tunes on pig meat tonight. Oh my God. Mm. Mm. So that is some goodness right here, y'all. That is some goodness. Cause it's a sweet thing, pig feet type of night. And the, the, the dessert is some more some more Tito's. And some more Tito's. Game got fans. Game got fans. Um supposedly, for what I saw, for what I saw, the the the, the, the dream team, the dream team, uh, what uh, uh, the media was telling you, the dream team ain't so dreamy. It ain't so dreamy right now, either. Mm -mm. because the game cost when it's a hostile, 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 hostile environment. We went to a hostile environment. And, and, and all in the whiteout, and then we, we, you know, doing, they had the, all the turn up, they had the flames, they had the, the, the purple carpet, they had all these things going on, all these things going on. And I'm like, whoa, they, they're ready for business, right? And they came out on fire. So you recall in the pregame show that Captain Will does, you recall in the pregame show, I said that LSU will be winning after the first quarter. And they were, they came out on fire. They came out on fire and they won the first quarter. They won the first quarter. They won the first quarter, and it was up by, what, six points, five points? They did. And they was making all these shots. They were doing work. You had eight, Anissa Morrow shooting back-to-back -back three pointers, and she was an 18% three-point shooter. But they was on fire. They had the adrenaline going. They was like, uh, 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 uh. and they jumped on us. They jumped on us. Ashlyn Watkins said, Two quick fouls. Played three minutes at two fouls. She ain't played no more until the second half. Fourth quarter. Zania Fagan had two fouls. And you got the first quarter. From then on, South Carolina, like Captain Will said, like South Carolina, like I said, like Captain Will said, I said that methodically, South Carolina would slow him down and eventually win by 10 to 15 points. Well, we didn't win by 10 to 15 points. We won by six points. But I tell you what, I would have been right. I would have been right on point if, and if, and if, and if, and if, Tina Pow Pow would have hit a couple of three-pointers in the first half. She came out on fire the second half with nine points. I would have been on point. I would have been on point if Camila Cardoza would have hit some of those bunnies. But she stood her ground. She stood her ground. Ain't no, it, 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 Camila Cardoza did what she did. You know, I would have been on point. Because at the end of the day, the only thing I care about is a W. That's all I care about is a W. Against a really good basketball team. LSU is a tough basketball team. They are a tough basketball team. They are. And, and and they played well. They played well. They had the crowd. Now, if the game was in Carolina, it would be a different story because the crowd would be in our favor. We've been lit. You know what I'm saying? But but it wasn't. It wasn't. So they played well. Kim Mulkey had a game plan to take Pow Pow out of the game. And it worked the first half. She had a game plan. But see, when you take out Pow Pow, Raven Johnson went to work in the first half. She went to work. And you take out Cardoza. Chloe Kitts went to work the first half. So, so it, 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 it's something about having a whole bunch of weapons on a basketball team. It's something about having a whole bunch of weapons on a basketball team because you have a whole bunch of weapons on a basketball team. That means that you, if a player's not playing as well, that player could come out. If a player has foul trouble, thus player can come out. The problem with LSU, and they got a lot of heart, they got a lot of heart. They played tough. They played tired. But the problem with LSU and why LSU is not on the standard, is not on the level of South Carolina, and I think it's 15 straight games against LSU. Now, Kim Mulkey hasn't been there that long, but I, that's two straight games uh, uh, LSU has lost to South Carolina. That's that's what I can say. We beat them on y'all court. Then y'all came us and we beat the brakes off of y'all. Y'all don't have a bench. And that caught up with your girls. I said that was going to happen. 
Somebody need to post this, post this, post this. Captain Will is Nostradamus. I know the future of what's going to go on. I know what's going to happen. I know that's what I do. So, so we had a lovely lady. Lovely lady made an awesome comment. And, and, and this is from LSU. She made a whole soliloquy, made a whole page long comment talking about how uh, LSU is going to beat South Carolina and the reasons why LSU is going to beat South Carolina. And, 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 um, and, um, I don't know, I don't know who you are and I don't know what you did, but you, you don't know no damn basketball. So I may not know basketball, but I know what I do know. I know we beat y'all, but I may not know basketball. It's all good. But I know we, I, I know my family. I know my family. Again, I talk with Captain Will. I know my family is drinking sweet tea. I know my family is gnawing on some pig feet. I know that. Look at this juicy juice. Oh, God. Mm. Mm. I know my family doing that. I'm not sure what your family doing. I'm not sure. I know y'all family gonna come up with some excuses. Mm hmm. LSU gonna come up with some excuses. They're gonna say all about the refs, but the refs suck. The refs suck on both sides. I don't know what the hell they was doing. I don't know. And when they do a grading report on the refs, they need to get a C, D, F, G, all them. They do, cause they weren't good. They weren't good. It was a ticket tack fouls. It was a foul that should have been called on both sides. It was. It was. And, and, and they're going to say that, oh, if Angel Reese was in the basketball game, we would have won. Well, she wasn't in the basketball game and you lost. So I only know those shoulda, coulda, woulda. I don't know what that. Now, she had a solid game. She had, what, 15 points, eight rebounds? She had a solid game. She had a decent game. She had a decent game. But it wasn't like Angel Reese was lighting up the world now. No, 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 no. Don't get it twisted now. Yeah, she wasn't lighting up the old fireplace. You know, go. South Carolina was, you know, we don't, we don't, depend, see this, we don't depend on one player. Player, y'all depend on the player. Oh, Angel Reese. Oh, Angel Reese down. She got she in foul trouble. Oh, what we gonna do? Oh, woe is me. Oh, woe is me. What we gonna do? Because Angel Reese is down. No, Gamecocks don't rely on one player. That's what LSU fans don't understand. We don't need a player getting 25 points, 30 points. We don't need that. And I'm talking about LSU. I'm talking about uh uh uh. Iowa, I'm talking about UConn, I'm talking about uh, Virginia Tech, Stanford, UCLA, any of those teams that depend on one or two players. South Carolina does not. And some people look at me crazy when I say Tahina Pow Pow should be SEC Player of the Year. And I say she should be SEC Player of the Year because she's the best player on our basketball team. And we have to be the number one team in the country. I don't give a damn about no stats. I don't care. Stats don't matter with that. We are the number one team with a bullet and a star and a circle and a smiley face now after we beat LSU in their place, in their place, in their gym, in their sold-out arena. It don't matter. It don't matter. South Carolina didn't play the best basketball tonight. We didn't. We didn't play our A game tonight. We did not play our A game tonight. We play, probably played a B to a B plus type game. That's what we did. That's what we did. And we still won by six points. Still, still almost covered. The line was six and a half. We still almost covered. Now, some of y'all not betting folks. I understand. I understand. I get it. But South Carolina put in that work once again. Once again. Once again, we did that work. It might not look pretty all the time. It might not look pretty all the time, but we put in that work. So what we're going to do right now, this is what we're going to do right now. I am going to open the phone lines. I'm going to open the phone lines because I want to talk to some of y'all. I want to talk to some of y'all. The, the, the number is right there on the bottom of the screen. Call Captain Will. Chop it up. Let's have a conversation. Ask me a question. Do all that stuff that 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 y'all want to do anyway. Let's have a good time. But I tell you this right here: no crazy stuff. No crazy stuff. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. So call the number. 
Let's chop it up. Let's do this thing. Mm-hmm. Let's do this. So, and I ain't ate pig feet in a while. I have not ate pig feet in a while, but it's damn good. I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh, we got a call. This is the first call. Got a call. Let me see. Call from... To accept, press 1. To send a voicemail, press... Hey, this Captain Will. You're on the air. What's up? Hello? Oh, guess I got nervous. All right. Somebody call. I guess that, that cat got nervous. Hey, um, I want to say thanks to Alan Pavon. Alan Pavon just joined as a bronze member. Just join. Okay, we got another call. Let's try this out. Call from Larry James. To accept, press one to send a voicemail. Hey, you on the air? You on the air with Captain Will? Talk to me. Hey, Captain Will. What's up, partner? Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? I'm doing well. Good. Oh, uh, uh, great game, great game. Really enjoy your show. Thank you, brother. And you calling from Jersey. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Yeah. I've yeah. been a long time South Carolina fan. Oh, awesome. A long time fan. Good, 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 brother. What, what, what was your question, man? I enjoy the fact that you, the question, I, I have no question. The question was answered tonight. <laughs> question was answered tonight. I love it. I love it. I love it. Question. And, yeah, it, 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 go ahead. It was a great game. Mm -hmm. South Carolina showed what kind of grit they have. Yes. And the greatness of their coach. Yes. 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 Say it, brother. That is it right there. Because when you have a, uh, 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 when you are, I mean, come on. This is a young team. This is a young team now. Yeah. This is a young team. These girls, yes, it is. They, they have not been in this situation. So this is new. This is brand new. So, other than Cardoza, who came off the bench last year, this is new for these players. You know, Breezy didn't play much last year, so this is new. So, that, hey, love it, brother. Love it. Love it. Hey, hey you keep up the good work. I, 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 I'll keep watching. Appreciate you, brother. Thank you, man. Have a good night. Yeah. Hey, appreciate it. Appreciate it. This is a young team, y'all. This is a young team. This is a young team. So we just got to keep on working. Keep on working. Hey, we got another call in this. Let's this, this chop it call up. from Low Country Inc. Mobile Notary. To accept, press 1. To send a voice. Hey, you on with Captain Will. Talk to me. Captain Will. Hey. What's up? What's up? This is the Country Notary. Country Notary. Hey, girl, what's going on? How you doing? Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh God. Let's go. Captain Will, I was I had 10 nails before the game started. <laughs> now I have minus three. <laughs> oh my Negative god. three. I don't even know where they I don't know where they went. Oh yeah. my god. Oh hey, my god. It was a nail biter. It was. It was a nail biter. It was. But do you know what? You know what? That's you know, what that's what we needed. You you're right. That's what we needed. You're right. We learned how to play it ugly tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, play through tough a tough tough situations. Yes. And the, and the veterans, Raven yes. and Breezy, Say stepped it. up in key moments of yes. the game. Like, key moments. Yes. Poor Wally, too, she had a couple of good... She kept us in the, the, the second quarter. She did. She, she kept did. us in the game. We needed you know? those. Hey. Because she ain't scared. Poor Wally ain't scared. No. no <laughs> that no. girl, she, was, she loves She was it. playing basketball. She was playing like my, my five-year-old grandson. She was smiling on the court. <laughs> But she, I mean, she's she, smiling on the court. She's from the country. This was the girl, dude. This is what she do. Hey. You know what I'm saying? So you got to give more credit because I know I hear all about, you know, the city girls, the city, you know, all this stuff. But this is a country girl. These girls ain't scared of nothing. Right. And then for a while, it's, right, right. So, I mean, I, I love I love the way she plays. I love the way she plays. But it is. Right. It Fagan. Is, oh, yeah. Fagan and Fagan getting a lot Fagan more minutes well. now. And, and, and come on, Chloe. Fagan did well. Chloe was doing Chloe. it. Yeah. I mean, you know, you know. So, 
we did our thing. We have we missed a few opportunities, of course. Kyle was off. Yep. But at the end of the day, we we showed up. We, we did. showed up. So country, um, country you know, we, like we, we have a team. We have a team. Right. We don't have one we player. Have a squad. We have a squad. We have a squad. We have a squad. A squad. So if you have a squad, if, if Pow Pow's off now Sunday, she's gonna be lighting up the joint, you know. But we have a team. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, and yeah. so it's all love. It's and it's it's so awesome talking to you too. I really appreciate you. Yes, yes, Captain. Keep doing what you do, Captain. Appreciate you. All right. Hey, hey, one more thing. One uh -huh. more thing. Y'all hit the like button. Hey, lick the like button. Yeah, girl. <laughs> hit the like button. All right. All right. Talk Thank to you, you Captain. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hey, so yeah, it's awesome. It's awesome. We we have a team, y'all. We have a team. We have a team of of very good players. If one player is off, the next player steps up and steps in. That is how we do. That is how we do. Hey, the, the phone lines are going off the chain, and that is amazing. So if you don't come on, get on, just keep trying. Call from. All right. To accept, press one to send a voice. That's how we do. Hey, this guy Will. How you doing? Hello. Hey, this guy Will. Talk to me. Yeah, you, you you know what it is? Dawn teach her girls sportsmanship. Mm. They don't play with arrogance. Mm. They don't play with showing off. They play consistent ball and they maintain their cool. Yes. And they let it every time this other team shot. Oh, 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 oh. They just play it down. They tie you out. And yes. Because they don't have a bit. Yes. The girls exhausted. Yes. They play the whole game. Yes. Dawn the girls. Yes. Dawn is a mastermind of the mind. Yes. Yes. Love you, Captain Will. Hey. New York. Hey. Love you, Captain Will. Appreciate you, Love girl. You. Appreciate you. Man. Appreciate you. Thank All you. Right. Bye bye. Later. Hey, y'all keep calling in. Love the calls. Love the calls. And we got a whole lot of people watching right now. So the folks who are new, the folks who are new right now, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you 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 like, make sure you tell a friend, tell an enemy, tell your baby mama, tell the person you cheating with right now who you're supposed to be with your girl, but you actually with the other girl. But but it's OK. Just tell somebody about Captain Will. We got another caller. Let's talk. Let's talk. Call from Ben Collins. To accept. Will. Hey, this Captain Will. Talk to me. Captain Will, what's up, man? Hey. It's Ben Collins, your army brother. Hey, what's good, brother? What's good? Talk to me. Hey, we bought Mike the Tiger down tonight, didn't we? Oh, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> hey, they thought they were sweet, but we got a hold of them. Yep. We played a good game. Yep. I love what we did in the stretch. Yes, yes. Three yes. halls kept up big time. Yes. Because, you know, in the first half, you know, Bree, I, Bree's not really... I, she's not gonna like uh try to take over the game herself, you know what I'm saying? But she lets it come to her. And why they leave them open like that? Like that was crazy of <laughs> them. I don't know what they was doing. Like, come on, this girl has shown herself. Captain Will, Talk. if we was in South Carolina, that game would have never been as close as it oh, was in no, LSU. Probably no, crowd. no, no. Like the crowd, I would say tonight, the crowd probably helped them, I would say maybe about six points, six or seven points. They really did. I agree with you. Cause, cause I, I agree with you 100%. Because our girls are new to this. You know what I'm saying? They are new. So yeah. when we play in the tournament, oh, this is not a surprise now. This is not a surprise. No. So this victory. That like that would never happen again. Oh, no. No. No way. No way. So Because next time it's going to be a neutral court. Neutral court now. Definitely. So when we play, Definitely. when we play again, because we could play LSU again, we might play them in the SEC tournament. But we play in the SEC tournament, that's in Greenville. Okay? That's our time. And that's, that's, our, that's our place. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So we're going to be a white out or a black out or whatever out, garnet out, whatever it is, exactly. we're we going to be doing it. But I appreciate, appreciate your call, brother. Okay, and I'll see you when we play Tennessee and South Carolina too, brother. Hell and yeah. To talk to you too, brother. Hell yeah, you sure will. Already. All right, brother. Already. Have a good night, right, brother. brother. Mm, bye bye. So, um, let's go through a couple of questions. Call from oh, Jasmine. Oh, my bad. Hold on. To accept, press one. Ah, uh, hey, you on with Cam Will? Talk to me. 
Hey, Captain Will, it's Jazz, man, from Detroit, Michigan. Detroit, what's up? What's up? What's good? Nothing. I just love South Carolina. Bree Hard did her thing. Yes. Um, I feel like she gonna do a Raven Johnson. She gonna come back get next year or be in her bag like Ooh. Raven Johnson did this year. I'm looking forward to it. Yes. But laser for a while. Yeah, I can't wait till she get developed. Mm. They you... gonna be undefeated. Hey, I, I mean, I don't see why not. I don't see why not. Cause they're only getting better. Only yes. getting better. Yes. This game is so yes. important. And I'm new to your channel. Yes, new you, your channel. I hit the like button and I did subscribe. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, girl. Really do appreciate it. Keep doing you. Go game cops. Go game cops. Thanks for calling, okay? Have a good night. You too, right? Bye bye. You too. Hey, I want to go through a couple of um I want to go through a couple. Okay, hold on. The phone lines is like really going crazy. It's really going crazy. So I want to go through a couple comments. All right, so Alan Pavon, I want to thank you. I want to thank you so much uh, for being a bronze member. And if you're a bronze member, silver member, gold member, just a, a follower of Captain Will, I do appreciate everything. And if you're curious about how to be a member, you can go um, go to my YouTube channel and on the uh, you'll see on the memberships and you'll see what you can do to tell you all the instructions and so forth. And uh, we're going to start doing more and more stuff. Uh, related to the memberships, I know um, I got a T-shirt that is in in the works right now. I got wine glasses. I got we're gonna we're gonna have a lot of lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. So, um, oh my um, hey, shout out to my son-in-law. Shout out to my son-in-law. Shout out to my son-in-law Avery up in Seattle, Washington, doing his thing, having a great time, and um, you know. A great, great young man, also a graduate of Fayetteville State. You know, watch this kid grow up into a a a a, a responsible, smart, intelligent young man, and 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 putting in his work over there. I, I really appreciate you, Abe. So, like, Abe, man, I love you, man. We will see you in a, a couple months. See you in a couple months, man. Um, Shondell Matthews, y'all, please hit that like button. Please hit the like button. We got six hundred and sixty-one people watching us right now and i always say us because it ain't just me it ain't just me it's never just me it's always y'all it's always y'all it's always y'all so just hit the like button uh philip harris winning games like that in that environment makes you better it does it does it makes you so much better it makes you so much better because like like my man collins was talking about you know when we get to another environment uh, that's quote unquote hostile. It won't be another environment like this right here when we play. You know, when we go to Tennessee, it'll be decent, but it won't be like this. It won't be like this. They were out for blood and they came up. Shout. How about that? Um, USC Game Cop fam, Bree Hall is a clutch. Every game, it comes down to the end. She has big shots. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. She likes the moment. She loves the moment. And, 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 and I want her to continue this because she's been doing it. She's been doing it. Hey, we're going to take another call. Let's take another call. Take another call. Call from... Trung Fine. To accept, press one. Hey, you on with Captain Will. Talk to me. Hey, Will. How you doing, buddy? I'm this good. Hey, I'm what's, talk to me. All right, man. You know what? I was just watching the game today. Yeah. And uh, first half, I was kind of worried. But, you know, the good thing, the, the best part was LSU was uh, used up all the energy on defense mm -hmm. at halftime, and they were only down by five. So mm -hmm. I wasn't worried. I knew mm -hmm. they would run out of gas by the end of the fourth quarter. Yep. So uh, great win for the Gamecocks. So shout out to them. Yes. And go Gamecocks. Go Gamecocks. Appreciate you taking my call, Will. Hey, appreciate you, brother. Thank you, brother. Have a good night. Hey. Uh, let's see. Ethan Trembley, Don Staley went in that locker room at halftime and talked some sense into my ladies and won to stay in the feet of South Carolina against the world, baby. And she did because the second half, she can't, the girls came out focused. We got more offensive rebounds like in the first two minutes than we got the whole first half. We had three offensive rebounds the first half, three of them. That's what we had. We were not playing our brand of basketball, but it's fine because we finally, we did. We did. And we play our brand of basketball. It's a wrap. It's a wrap, ladies and gentlemen. It's a wrap. Shaquem. Shaquem said he won 400 tonight. 
That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do. Let's go. Come on. Yo, we 30 minutes in. We 30 minutes in. A lot of comments. A lot of, lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. A lot of phone calls. And, and I think it's time once again for shot o'clock. I think it's time once again for shot o'clock. So, so for all my 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 homies that's all uh, that is enjoying life tonight, for everybody who's still celebrating and talking about the ones who ain't got to work tomorrow, or if you got to work tomorrow, you might want to call in. Let's do another shot. Let's do another one. Still doing the Tito's. Still doing the Tito's. Call from LKA Amy. Except press one to send a voicemail. Press two. What did I do? Woo. Call from. Hey, you on with Captain Will? Talk to me. Yo, what's going on, Captain Will? Hey, what's good? What's good? How you doing? Man, I can't complain, man. Doing pretty good. Calling out of South Carolina, man. You know, man, what? that game had me up on my feet. What part? What part of South Carolina, man? Right in Columbia, man. Okay, bet. Okay. In Columbia, man. Okay. But yeah, man, that game had me on my feet, man. I just think this will wake up, you know, for them to get better, man. Hey, we need these games, bro. We need them. We don't need to blow yeah, out every most, team. Most definitely. Because you don't most learn as much. It's just a wake up. It's a wake up for them, you know, to you know see what they need working on. Yep. And to get better. Yep. And execute. Yep. Yep. So, you know, and um, I think Chloe, she had a great, phenomenal game. Yes. Up, you know. Yes. Big time players step up at big time plays. Say you know, that. This is the game that they stepped up. Yes. Yes. You know, and um, I think my, um, Malaysia for a while, she should have played. Um, she could have got in a little bit more. It's, yeah. And I think she's been doing her thing, but you know, Don, you know, she's been doing this. She know what she's doing. Exactly. So I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. One thing I would not do, I would not question what Don Staley does. I will not do it because it's a uh -huh. method to the madness, bro. It's a method. Oh yeah, most definitely. You know, it's I, most definitely, most definitely. But she has so many keys and so many weapons. Exactly. You know, and the bench. Yes. You got to look at the bench. Yes. I think Pow Pow. You know, she could have stepped up a little bit more. But you have those type of games. Yeah. You know, where you're gonna have some offense. Yes. And you're gonna have some ones where you go hard. Yes. But this was the game where she had need to be shown. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I agree with you. I agree with you completely. Pretty, yeah. And it, it, it's, it's many more to come. It's many more oh, to come. for sure. And I should not know, second so, half. I mean, I just think this is a lesson learned. Yeah. This now, is a lesson learned. For second half, she had nine points now. Lady game talk to execute. Yeah. I expect Pow Pow to go off on Sunday against yeah. Vanderbilt. I expect her to go off. Oh, yeah, most definitely. I expect her to go most off. Most definitely. You know, so. Because you know what? Don said it going straight to the drawing board. Oh, for sure. And, and, and LSU had a plan I for Pow. You saw how they was defending her the first half. Oh, yeah, most definitely. You but know. they didn't know that they had Malaysia flow wide. You know, nobody went focused on her. Yeah. Or they went focused on Bree. And you see what happened? Exactly. Big time players step up and big time plays. Absolutely. And that's what they did. Absolutely, brother. Absolutely. So I appreciate that. And I ain't going to take all your time, man. All right, brother. Most definitely, man. Y'all subscribe to Captain Will, man. And like that button, man. Y'all hey. take care. Nice speaking with you, brother. Hey, you too, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night, man. Most definitely. Most definitely. Hey man, hey we, we oh okay Amy oh you, this one been calling a lot. Let me see what she got. One. Just... Hey, this Captain Will talk to me. Hey Captain Will, how you doing? Come, come coming to you from Bumpus, Virginia. Mmm. VA VA. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Alumni. Ah. Been to the game. Since the 1980s. Ooh, okay. Bree Hall. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Get Bree it. Hall. Get she it. Is the woman. She is. That's what I'm talking about. We, she showed it tonight. She showed it. Girl. She, 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 if you don't know her name, you know it now. I know her. Hey, I've been knowing her name. That's, that's well, what. I know your name. <laughs> and I, I thank you so much for what you do for the girls broadcasting, making them there, baby. You you are awesome, Cat Thank Will. you. Thank you. girls couldn't have been no better tonight. They could not have been any better tonight. Thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. Look, coming back down there to a game, I was down there a few weeks ago. Uh-huh. 
Um, you were, and I think you were on a trip out in some tropical paradise. <laughs> you funny. <laughs> <laughs> so, yep. But I came down there to uh, visit my daddy. He's 93 years old. Mm. Been a big game cop fan his whole life. His awesome. Whole life. Tell, you, tell your dad I say hello. Absolutely. I hope to get to see you someday down there on the court. You definitely will. You definitely will. So have a good night, okay? Thank you for what you do. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Have a good night. Right, you too. Bye bye. Hey, we're gonna um we're gonna hold off right now because there's so many calls. We're gonna hold off right now with the calls and we're gonna get back into some um questions because I still got a lot of questions too. A lot of questions. So we're gonna hold off on the calls. And we'll get back to it. I appreciate, I appreciate all the love, all the love I do. I really do appreciate it. So the uh I want to thank uh Virgil Wimberly. I want to thank Virgil Wimberly, uh five dollar tip. Thank you, thank you, brother. You always chime in. I'm always responding back to your comments. And and here's the thing, y'all. Here's the thing. There are, I get so many comments. We get so many comments and stuff. And I try to get back to all of them as quick as possible. Sometimes I'm not able to. But let I just want to let you know, if I don't get back to your comment, I will eventually, okay? I will eventually. I will eventually. Uh, shout out to my, one, another one of my daughters, Patty B, Postal Girl, Patrice Brazil. Wow, that was a good game. See, this is the thing. This is the thing. So, when I started this podcast last year, it, it, it really became like a family affair. You know what I mean? Came a family affair. And Patty B, Patrice, is the oldest of all the kids. She's the oldest. She's the elder of all the kids. And she started like, like Pops, you need to get on your um, Instagram. You need to get on your Instagram. I don't Instagram. I said, I ain't no Instagram type dude. So she working on that with, with me with Instagram. And I love her just like I love all my babies. Love her. Adam Ritter, Adam Ritter, what's good, my guy? I was wrong. Adam Ritter, I'm going to tell you, brother, I appreciate the comment. Because it takes, if, 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 if we would have lost tonight, I would have been wearing the T-shirt, LSU. I've been wearing the BOA. I've been doing all these different things. I've been doing all these different things. Because a bet is a bet, and I'm a man of my word. Now, you... You know, you came out and said you were wrong. If I'm wrong about something, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. And I'm sure it's going to be a time where I'm wrong about something. There would not be every game, you know, it, 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 we just, I'm just, Cam Wilkins is going to say, like, yo, uh, we just going to blow this team out. We're going to do this, that, and third. One of these days, I'm going to come out and say, oh, we're going to lose this ball game. I got a feeling we're going to lose this ball game. That ain't happened yet. And I don't see that in the foreseeable future. But I'm saying, when, whenever that happens, because it's not, a, it's just a, I'm going to speak the truth, whether it's good or bad, happy or sad. You know what I'm saying? So every time, every time, I believe Pow Pow is the best player on this basketball team. I believe that yesterday, and I believe it today. I believe that today. We needed her nine points in the second half. Those are facts. Those are facts. Do I think she's going to go off on Saturday, Sunday? Hell yeah, I think she's going to go off on Sunday. Because she knows she, her three wasn't, she wasn't falling tonight. It will on Sunday. It will on Sunday. Trust and believe that one. You know what I'm saying? So, so, I, I'm, I'm, cause uh, my wife and I watching the game, doing this, doing this at the third and everything. And we just like, like, uh, oh, Powell's not shooting. I said, I, I said, I don't, I take, um, no, she didn't say Powell wasn't shooting. She said, oh, for, like these last couple of possessions, I said, only person I want to shoot the ball is Pow Pow and Bree. I don't want nobody else shooting the ball. Nobody else. And what happened? Pow Pow found Bree, hit a three. Those are our money. Makers, those are our money makers, and Bree was on tonight. She was on tonight, and I loved every second of it. Every second of it. So, uh, flatline Fly J kept pow pow non fact in the first half. She did. Fly, Fly J is an excellent defensive player, she is, but you can't keep you can't keep good players down. Come on now. And in the second half, she had nine points, could have been 12, could have been 15. Pow pow. If her three was falling to down, she could have had a historic game for the Gamecocks tonight. She could have. She really could have. Uh, what happens next? Thank you so much for the tip. I really do appreciate it. It was, it, she said, uh, or he said, whoever, what, what happens next? I, I was, it was like each player had a quarter where they shine. I love the teamwork. You, have, you know, that's a great way 
of thinking about it. Each quarter had each player had a, 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 a shine in, in, in separate quarters. Bree Hall, the fourth quarter. I would say um, for Wiley, the second quarter. Chloe, the first quarter. Everybody, you know, but that's, I mean, we have so much talent on this basketball team, y'all. We have so much talent on this basketball team. And when a player gets in foul trouble, that's just another opportunity for another player to come in. When a player for LSU gets in foul trouble, that all, all we just all everybody just solemn like 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 I just lost my my bestie. You know what I'm saying? My bestie just moved across the country or something. Carolina next next girl up. Get ready. The tie them shoes up tight. Let's go. Uh, Chris Gray injuries had at least nine foul. Bro, who you telling? It was sometimes I'm like, what in the world are they calling? She should have found out well before that. And Morrow should have found out too. When I rewatch this game tomorrow, I'm like, hold on, hold on. This is not the way it's supposed to be. But it's all good. We got the victory. We got the victory. We standing on business. We are standing on business tonight. And that's all you can say. What the hell? I said emergency. My fault. I guess I initiated emergency SOS. So maybe the log gonna come over here. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's so if the law shows up, then baby, if somebody come over asking, uh, knocking on the door, is 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 because I did something wrong on my phone. All right, let's answer another call. Let's do this. Call from Eric. To accept, press one to send a voice. Hey, you on with Captain Will? Talk to me. Hey, Captain Will, this hurt for Columbia. How you doing, my brother? Hey, I'm doing good, brother. How you doing, man? I'm great. I'm great. Look here. Look here. Now, we didn't have our best game tonight, but what we did, we weathered the storm in a hostile environment. Mm. And I told my son, if we can keep it within five points, four quarter, we'll take it. And, and hey, hey, them girls stepped up in the fourth quarter. That's it. That's all you want, man. That is all you want. That, that's all? And that's, that's what happened. That's all you want, Cal. That's all. That's the, that, that's what happened. Uh, we, go ahead, bro. We don't. We don't. Like I was telling somebody earlier, we don't need to have a blowout every game. The girls ain't learning as much from that. They learned so much tonight. So much. They. We need some of this. We yeah. Need some of this. Some of the close games. And and we hadn't had no hostile environment like this. And I think in the beginning that got to them some. Yeah. But they settled down. I'm going to tell you, I think Fuwali, boy, I don't think she's scared of nothing. No, I don't think she's afraid think of she's nothing. Of nothing. nothing. Yeah, she ain't scared of nothing. And, and I'm going to tell you this, too. Uh, Raven, that's Hollywood right there, man. The oh. entire game, we needed her. She, she played. things down, man. We she, needed her in the game. She played tonight, man. She played tonight. Yes, she did. And I know she wanted to do well against yes. a girl. You know, Angel and her are tight. Yeah. So, but... You know, in yeah. that last foul, you know, Angel got, I think that, that she fouled Raven, if I believe, um, that fouled her. hit on the arm. Hit on the arm. Terrible foul. Yeah. Terrible foul. Yeah. 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 So, hey, man, I appreciate you still, your call. You go, yeah. Hey, man, you take care. Take care, brother. All right. I appreciate it. Have a good night, man. Uh, hey, uh, Antonio, this is a precursor to the tournament. Yes. Antonio, you are absolutely right. You're absolutely right. You are absolutely right. Because you uh we need these games like this, and we need Call to play. Michelle Mo. We need to play like this. Hey, this Captain Will. Hi, hey, what's up? Talk to me. Hey, Captain Will. This is Michelle Malone, all the way from Oklahoma. Hey, what's up? What's good? Man, Captain Will, listen, I was so hyped tonight. This game, I'm a professor at Lacey University. Okay. The only HBCU in Oklahoma. Ooh. And when I tell you I was hyped to see these South Carolina game cocks play, it was everything I thought it was going to be. What a tough game. Yes. I cannot wait for OU to move to the SEC. Ooh, yes. Because that'll give me a chance to see my South Carolina game cocks. Even though I'm an Okie and I'm an OU fan. I'm going to represent my South Carolina Gamecocks. 
when they when we if we get to play them, I'm sure we will. I'm sure we will. An awesome game. Yes. I'm so excited. Keep doing what you're doing. This is awesome. Thank I've, you. I've seen others, mm -hmm. but you are the best. Oh, and thank I love you. rocking with you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your call. All right. Have a good night. All right. Have, have a good. Have a good night, sis. Bye bye. Bye bye. Call from Ernie Weber. Six. Ernie Weber, what's good? What's good, man? Hey, what's happening, Cap? Hey, you doing, brother? Uh, all good, man. On on my end. Good. Talk to me. Say, once Chloe gains about 10, 15 more pounds, she's gonna be a stud. Yes. Yes. Yes, she is. That's that's the only thing that she's missing. That's that is it. That is it. She's she gonna be a beast. She is. She is. I love the game. Love the show. Thank you love so much. Podcast. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you. And Ernie, Ernie is one of my guys who comments all the time. Love this dude. Have a good night, brother. Yes, sir. All right. So we have to. We have to acknowledge, we have to recognize, we have to give some, some love to Chloe Kitts. We have to, because she was dealing that first quarter. She was not afraid of the moment whatsoever. And she, you have some players, you have some players that uh, might shrink in front of the moment. Chloe don't. Chloe does not. Full Wally does not. Pow Pow does not. She found a way to get to the basket. She got to the th uh, free throw line. She hit a couple of threes. She played solid defense. Raven, we have players on this team. Breezy Hall, we have players on this team who wants that moment, who wants to take those tough shots, who wants to guard their best defend, their best offensive player. We have those players. And with, with, with Coach Staley and, 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 and this team, because Full Wilder played a good portion of the second quarter, she didn't play much the second half. She didn't play much the second half, but she did her job. She sure did her job in that second quarter, and she did, and she kept us in the ball game. She did her job. Now, there are going to be times in her sophomore, junior year that Full Wild is going to light up ESPN. But last, today, i tell you this right here. There should be no conversation. There should be no conversation on, on, on the airways, on the, the byways, on the, the dirt roads, or any of that stuff. We're comparing Michaela Williams, Michaela Williams, and Malaysia Full Wild. Don't, don't, don't make those comparisons. Don't make those comparisons. If we go, if we go just on the game tonight, and that's the only thing we can talk about. Full Wild outplayed Williams. She outplayed her. She, I mean, I, I, Williams wasn't on at all tonight. But Full Wally let the world on notice tonight that who that freshman is in limited minutes. So she's not playing 35 minutes like a, a Juju Watkins is. She ain't. She averaging about 18 minutes a game. When her time comes, bro, it's going to be something. It's going to be something. Brain drain. Brain drain. Thank you for the, the tip. Thank you for uh, the bronze level membership. I appreciate it. Chloe Kitts is the real MVP. Kept USC in the game. Chloe did some work tonight. Chloe did some work tonight. And, you know, I, every night, every time after the game, I'll, I'll do the co-MVP and all this stuff. I, I ain't doing I, I, the, the, the team is the MVP tonight. The team. We could talk about Chloe. We could talk about Full Wally. Just like somebody commented earlier, we had a different player show out in every quarter. And at the end of the day, the team, South Carolina, beat the team LSU in their environment. You know how hard that was. How hard for a young team, five new starters, to come in to that environment and beat the reigning defending champions. That is so difficult. And Ellen Shue is a great basketball team with a great coach. Kim Mulkey can coach her butt off. They have a great basketball team. And we'll probably see them again in SEC tournament. We probably will. We'll probably see them again. And I hope so because this is great. This, tonight was so great for women's basketball, for women's sports. 
This was amazing. Having an all-female, you know, game day. All these different things. And then had Ryan Rizzullo calling the game Rebecca Lobo. But that's another conversation another day. And I'm not going to, tonight I'm not going to uh, talk about Rebecca Lobo and no Ryan Rizzullo. I'm not going to do that tonight. I ain't doing that tonight. I'm on good vibes. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to take another shot in about 10 minutes. I'm going to get nice and nice tonight and, 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 um, and enjoy this evening. And then tomorrow we'll do it all again and we'll start – uh, talk a little bit about more, more about this and the impact on women's basketball tomorrow. And then we'll jump into talking about Vanderbilt because it's the next game. We ain't going to sit here and, and wallow and, 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 and constantly, oh, we beat LSU, we beat LSU. Nah, it's on to the next one. This is just one victory. Just one, another victory. Now, it's a huge victory, but it's another victory. And we got to play a good Vanderbilt team at our place at 3 o'clock. Okay? 3 o'clock. And, 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 and game costs will be ready. They're going to be ready, and they're going to have a, a nice uh, trip back to Columbia, and they're going to, you know, I don't know if they're going to class tomorrow. Probably not, but uh, it's awesome. It is awesome. Um, Dion, Don is about her business. Make corrections and win shot by shot, point by point. No superstars. One team. No superstars. One team. I couldn't say it any better. Dion, I'm going to use that. No superstars, one team. That is South Carolina. You ask why. You ask why. Carolina is the best. The reason that South Carolina is the best, because of what Dion just said, no superstars, one team. We are a cohesive team, while other players are, uh, I would say, the NBA model. The NBA model, where they market players versus teams. They market players. We see a uh, 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 Caitlin Clark. We see a Paige Beckers. We see an Angel Reese commercial. Shoot, the first break, the first media timeout, we saw a Caitlin Clark commercial during our game. You know how hot I was. You know how hot I was when I saw that mess. And no, no shade to Caitlin Clark, but this is Gamecocks. This is LSU. I wouldn't have got mad if it was an LSU commercial. I wouldn't have got mad at all. I would not, because you showcasing the two teams that are playing tonight. But the first media timeout, the first break you showing a, a State Farm commercial with, with Caitlin Clark, nah, bro. Nah. Nah. It's hard to market South Carolina. It's hard. Because we are a basketball team, not a team full of me, 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 me's, but we are a team. We got one player. Uh, Kim Mulkin said, we, have to say, we got a whole, one, uh, one, one, uh, one player shooting 40 shots. We don't have that. We don't. We move the ball. We shoot the rock. We play defense. We congratulate each other. You play when you're asked to play. You're not guaranteed nothing. And we win basketball games. We win basketball games. That's what it is. Every time. Will we win all of Will we go undefeated this year? I don't know. I don't know if we're going to go undefeated this year. I don't know, but I do know that every single game South Carolina will be in every single game against whatever opponent it may be at whatever arena it may be in every single game Carolina will be in. How many teams can say that? Because there have been so many teams that has lost. Carolina's the only undefeated team, only undefeated team in the land. Playing now probably a top 15, top 12 strength of schedule. The only team in the country. Only one. That's South Carolina. Georgia kid. Raven Johnson is the best player on the team, in my opinion. I'm biased because she's from Georgia, and so am I. Hey, bro, uh, a girl, whoever. Georgia kid, I, you ain't being biased. You're telling your, your opinion. You are literally telling your opinion on what is what it's supposed to be or why you feel. So you, you ain't wrong with your opinion. I ain't I, my opinion is Raven Johnson, my favorite player on the basketball team. Anybody who know, who, who know Cam will know I say that Raven Johnson is my favorite player on this basketball team. She's my favorite player. And I and and, 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 I, and I probably am, am I biased probably. I don't care, but I don't give a damn. I don't care. So George Kidd, you say it. Raven Johnson played her butt off tonight. She played up butt off tonight. At Showtime, I'm a huge Caitlin Clark fan, but I don't think Iowa can play with South Carolina this year. With that improved three-point shooting and huge advantage inside, 
What Caitlin Clark did versus South Carolina was amazing, though. Showtime, appreciate the comment. I don't think Iowa... Well, I'm going to say this right here. Iowa ha will have a different, difficult time dealing with South Carolina. They will have a difficult time. They play fast. They play hard. They, 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 do, they do well. They do well. But, and they have a superstar offensively in Caitlin Clark. They do. I just feel that if we were to play Iowa, and I hope we play Iowa in the tournament, because there's some demons that needs to be exercised, I hope that we play them. I just feel that we would overwhelm with our, with our size and our defense. And last year, we didn't have the three-point shooting that we have this year. You cannot leave our three-point shooters open. We are shooting 44% for a reason. And I don't think Iowa could stop that. Iowa will get their points. Iowa will get their points. I mean, Caitlin Clark can get her points as well because she's going to shoot 35 times. So she's going to get her points. She's going to hit some of them. She's gonna shoot, but I don't think. No, I don't think so. But I appreciate the comment. And what Caitlin did last year, I mean, she balled her butt off. She did last year against us. She did. She did. So much respect to that too. Much respect. So many comments, so many comments, so much love tonight. And, 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 um, who else is a little nice right now? Anybody, anybody nice right now? I ain't nice right now. I want some, I want a burger. I really do. Let's answer this call. Call from. Clay. Hey, you on with Captain Will? Talk to me. Yeah, what's up, buddy? Hey, how you doing, man? What's good? All right, hey. Don got a versatile team. Yes. yes. Inside or outside. Yes. However you want it. Yes. She got it for you. Yes. Yes. It. And I'm I'm real proud of that team, man. It, it, they it, look good tonight. It's it's something it's something amazing to watch. You know how many? I want to see the ratings tomorrow, bro. I want to see the ratings tomorrow because yeah, because yeah, I think that you had Magic Johnson tweeting right before the game. I tweeted Magic. As a matter of fact, he ain't answer, of course. But I tweeted that brother. Really? You you got all <laughs> these people watching because there ain't no NFL game tonight. Ain't no NFL game tonight. Mm -hmm. This is eight o'clock right, on ESPN, right. and you you know you uh -huh. know ESPN loves LSU now. You know. So I want to see. Oh, yeah. Here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I want to see what these ratings are tonight. Cause, cause you can, yes, you, you can pick and choose who you want to support. But at the end of the day, this is, this is huge for women's sports, bro. We at 11 o'clock at night talking about women's basketball. How amazing is that? Thank you. It, it, it's Thank crazy, you. bro. This ain't how it was and when we grew up. In the women game to a different level. Yes. This ain't how it was when we grew up, man. This is different, bro. No, no. <laughs> no this is different. <laughs> this is different. This is a completely different animal now. And I love it. I got three girls. Yes, sir. And I love and I watch them play small ball all the time since they were five years old. You know what I'm saying? So, so I love uh -huh. this. I'm in my element watching women's basketball. Because I watch girls basketball up until the college. You know what I'm saying? So I love it. And I love the joy. <laughs> I it's love just it. So more, it's just so pure, man. Bro. It's so pure, man. The way you know they they they, they play basketball on the court. Mm -hmm. I, Absolutely. Hey, I appreciate you taking my call, buddy. Hey. I just want to say uh, I'm part of the team. Don is Don team is very versatile this time. It's not like last year. You know, we more inside game, but now we inside and out. Absolutely. We would have so, lost this game. I'm happy about this team, man. We would have lost this game. Yes. We would have lost this game. Exactly. We would have lost. We would have lost the game. Appreciate your call, thanks, brother. Thanks for taking my call, buddy. Absolutely. All right. Have a good night, bro. Call from. I don't know, Bill from Baltimore. Hey, what's good? You on with Captain Will? Talk to me. Captain Will, what's going on? This is Darnell. Hey, what's good, man? What's good? Talk to me, man. Hey, you already know, brother. Hey, I was locked in, baby. Yeah. I was locked in from soon as. It, as soon as the game came on, I was locked in. Yes. First of all, I want to give you a shout out. Shout out to you, brother. Shout out for you for always responding to my text message. Absolutely. I'm sorry for responding to my my Instagram feed replies. <laughs> always. 
I'm, I'm hitting you on uh, YouTube and tell you check out the young lady who was a freshman. Yes, yes. Shout out to you, brother. Thank you for the uh, great content. Uh, about tonight, mm. they just proved to me that they're going to win it all. That tonight uh, was night. Tonight was tonight. it. Yes. They just proved to me they're going to win it all. Also, we're going we're gonna to watch it. We're going to uh, come back to this. LSU don't have a bench that can actually give because Moro was tired. Yes. And uh Angel Reese was she was burnt out third yes, quarter. She was she kept asking for a break. Yes. And um I don't think they're gonna get past the sweet 16. It's gonna be Don't tough. Did a great shout out to Chloe. It's gonna be tough. Shout out to Chloe Kitt. Yes. For holding us down for 10 points in the first half when we need it. Yes. Full Wally is a dog. She is. I don't she might need to shoot an air ball a couple of times for her to get going. Yeah. But you can tell she is a dog. I'm yeah. not from South Carolina. My family's from South Carolina. I'm from Baltimore. You already know that. Yeah, yeah. But Jesus Christ, I don't know what y'all got. To, I don't know what y'all got the water down. She's a dog. <laughs> she is, bro. She ain't scared She's a at dog, all, man. She is not She's scared. She's not scared. If only thing she needs to do is learn the defenses when to go, when to like, when to go, when to slow it down. With her pace, because yes. I can see it in her. She yes. want to go every chance she, she wants, does, but she has to slow yep. down. Yes, please slow down. Shout out to ESPN finally put uh, uh, Don Staley on television. Thank LSU you, on television. Thank you, um, and not Ka not Caitlin Clark or Paige Beckers. Shout out for putting a black queen and all those black brown girls run up and down the court. Oh so, man, uh, that's going to give a lot of my nieces and a lot of. Black young ladies around the world, they're gonna they inspire them young ladies, man. Yeah, shout out to Raven Johnson. Yes, Raven came to play defensively, offensively. She got a couple couple of times she had a miss assignment, yeah, but she made up for it. Yes, um, I'm gonna say one of the key moments was uh, Full Wiley hit the jumper right before half that kept the game and they kept us because I knew it. I was like, we're gonna walk them down to that deep and we're gonna drown them. Yes, yeah, you knew it was gonna, gonna happen. Walk them down to that deep. And I, know, I, was just, I was just waiting. I was like, I looked over at you. I said, they are tired. Yeah. The young lady, Williams, who I really love. Yes. I, I, I think, I, I mean, offensively, she's great. She has to lose at least 10, 15 pounds. Yeah. She's not in game shape. She needs Molly. She got to come down. She needs Molly. She need. yeah. She needs she Molly. Need, she needs that. Yeah. That, she that need, is it. She need her. She need Molly. And she need Molly. And Chloe kids need to find a battle. She need to find a battle array uh, that she need to do. She, she need this summer. She needs to find, she need to take ballet, ballet lessons. Mm. Uh, Chloe, I mm. think she'll be much better because she's always off balance. Um, Pow Pow didn't have it tonight, but you and I talked about it. Yeah, Breezy yeah. Hall. She been yes. in this moment before. Yes, Cat. She hit the shot. Yes. against uh, Stanford last year mm. when we needed that shot. Mm. She's a junior. She, she knows there. it. She's gonna miss a couple shots, but she's gonna. We wanna. We always count. Her. I always count on. She's a junior. Mm. Man, I'm. I'm excited, man. I wanna, yeah. I'm, I'm, listen, I, I recorded a game day because yeah. I missed it before I got home. Yeah. I'm going to watch game day and going to watch the game again like I'm a coach. Same. I like, see what we do. I'm going to do it tomorrow <laughs> as well because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I ain't mess with game day today because I was doing my thing. I'm going to see what they're talking about and then I'm going to watch, I'm going to rewatch the game. And I, I always rewatch the game anyway, but I'm going to rewatch that game tomorrow morning. And because you, you know, when you're in the moment of watching the game, it's different when you rewatch the game. Is different. I know. You're you're seeing the each possession. You're seeing, you know, assignments miss, or you're seeing, you know, are you seeing who's dragging on defense? You know, you see all those things. I, I saw I saw Breezy get the I see her get the she got the bucket, the first bucket, and she yelled in Angel face like, Yeah, yeah, said, we fighting tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said we fighting tonight. Yeah, we fighting tonight. And then I said a little bump on uh, uh Camilla. I said, I don't know where the elbow, I mean she might have cut a couple elbows. But she came right back and yelled at Angel. Yeah. Angel brought it back. You know, she's from Baltimore. You know, I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm from East Baltimore. She's yeah. from Baltimore. Yeah. So she's going to bring that dug out of you. Yeah. I, I love that this women's game, they kept it competitive. Yes. They kept it classic, professional. Yes. No, help, no fighting. Yes. They show love to each other at the end of the day. Yeah, but absolutely. I'm telling you right now, LSU is gone in the Sweet 16. Hey, you said they it tonight. They cannot play in seven seven players. No. They were tired out there. Yeah. That drilling it was because of the fans. It That's wore, all. We it played wore. C. We yeah. gave them a C. What was it? I give them a C minus or a C plus F. I give them a C. A solid C. Because they, they actually took them to that deep end and drowned them. Mm -hmm. But other than that, we didn't play our best basketball. No. We didn't. No. But we, we, didn't. we, we out, our percentage was higher. Our three-point percentage was higher. Our free throws were a little better. 
um, we had more turnovers, two more turnovers than they did. Yeah. And we played in a high style of I see a Leah Boston. I said, yeah, she Leah up there with the blue head. She out there. Let's go. I'm like, fuck it. Yeah. Excuse my language. I'm in my house. She, I said, let's go. I yeah. didn't see nobody else. I didn't see Asia. Yeah. I didn't I wanted to see um um Zai. I didn't yeah. see Zai or anybody like that. But they I were tweeting though. Did. I yeah. Tweeting. yeah, they was tweeting they, they everything. Were tweeting? They was tweeting, yeah. Yeah, they was tweeting. Oh. Man. Yeah, there was there was. Let me tweet. ask you a question because I'm a, I know other callers was going to call and I don't want to hold up your time. I'm pumped up, but how do you think, honestly? Um, how do you think Camilla played the second half? Because I know she didn't play well the first half. The second half, how do you how you think Camilla played? I think she tried to be more aggressive and she came out tougher the second half. I think Don, mm-hmm. I think well, I tell you, I, I think Lisa Boyer got into her the second half mm-hmm. for her to be more aggressive. Mm-hmm. And she did play more aggressive. It's just she's still missing. She missed some shots that she shouldn't have missed, you know. Um, mm-hmm. But we need Camila Cardosa, bro. We need her. We do. We need her. We I, do. We, she- we got to have her. We got to have her. But I think what complements us is that Sanaya coming off the bench giving us eight points. What? Chloe is there to give us 10 points and then finish with 14. Yes. And then even though uh, Watkins was in foul trouble early on, she came out. Yeah. Aggressive. I think she ended with four or six points. Yeah. She with did. also defensive effort. Yeah. So even though Camilla don't, she's not going to dominate ever consistently like Aaliyah, but we have those power forwards coming off the bench. Absolutely. That's ready to go. That's Absolutely. that's a coach, man. Yeah. That's a coach. Absolutely. That's a team. You can sure. have the superstar that's on the television. I want that natty, bro. That's <laughs> what I'm sure. talking about. For sure. I want a party want in Cleveland, natty. bro. I want to party in Cleveland. I want that nag. <laughs> I want that nag. I'm playing for my plane ticket. Then my wife, we talk about oh, man. Playing, I'm I'm gonna pay for my plane ticket. I want that natty. For sure. I, I want, want that. Out because this is revenge tour. Like for Baby sure. said, this is revenge tour. She said and it. Baby came to play, bro. All right, man. She hey, came to play. Thanks for the call, brother. I know you hit me up tomorrow. We'll talk, man. You already know I'm tapping in. All hey, right, man. Yo. Get your likes up and subscribe to Captain Will. You already know you rocking with the best. Hey, <laughs> appreciate you, brother. Have a good night, man. You too. Peace. Hey, a couple more. Um, Amy KK, bronze level. Thank you, Amy. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Uh, brain drain, brain drain. Remember, Kits is really a freshman. Future bright reps did Ashton Watkins wrong. You know, with with Kits. Kits is um, Kits is so talented, and 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 and, and I, I want her. I want her to be so successful as a gamecock. I, I want her to be so successful. I want her to c- continue to get better. And I think, and I didn't think I know she's gonna get stronger because she gained fifteen pounds from last year. She's gonna gain another fifteen pounds, and and the stuff, some of the stuff that we see. Uh, that's going on now won't be happening next year. She will get stronger, y'all. And and, and brain drain, you you're, you're pretty much right. You know, she joined last year. She joined January of last year. That's when she joined. Joined last year. So so th- think of it in the concept of 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 um of of this. You got Adele Tat nursing an injury, but she joined Jane. She joined the January as well. Similar. Um, I, not a similar skill set because uh, Adele Tack is six foot five, long arms, can jump, going to be an intimidator when she's healthy. But in terms of experience, you know, I'm hoping that Adele Tack actually red shirts. I hope Adele uh, red shirt. Hope she red shirts and and, and 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 give it a little time. I do. But if she is fully healthy, I think she will grow similar to the way that Camille uh, that uh, Kits is growing. She is young, y'all, but she is not scared. She can get to the basket. She can rebound the basketball. She can shoot that mid-range jumper. She has a few moves. She can do the work. She can do the work, and I love it. Carl Dean, LSU fans, crying refs treated Angel and Fairly. Angel should have fouled out the game in the third quarter. I'm just keeping it real. She should have fouled out the game in the third quarter. And, and and stop LSU stop complaining about one player. You got 12, 13 players on that bench. They on scholarship too. They on scholarship too. The other players, they were great in their high schools as well. If 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 we and then if you you got a problem 
If you have a problem on your bench where you don't trust your players, go recruit better. Supposedly you had a number one recruiting class last year. That, that's what ESPN said. Say you had a number one recruiting class. Well, what's the problem then? What's the problem here? You had a number one recruiting class. You had the number one uh, in the transfer portal, but you're still only playing six and a half players. Come on now. Come on now. Uh, your girl, uh, pal, Payo, I'm saying the name wrong probably. She going for like two seconds. Two seconds. Make one mistake and get pulled from the game. Let the girls play. If I was a parent, I'd be like, damn, can my child play? She practice all this time? Can she play too? This is what you better watch out for LSU. You might see a mass exodus of some of these players transferring out because, 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 uh, because, because supposedly that you know only a couple of players getting all this NIL money. All this NIL money. There's gonna be a whole Netflix special or or something talking about NIL money, and they're talking about and the the, the, the we, we talking about Angel Reese. We talking about Caitlin Clark. You talking about old Paige Beckers. You talking about Fly J. So so, there's something going on. There's something going on, but when you have a, a top-heavy team like y'all do, and not depth, not depth along it, these are the problems you're gonna have. And if it was games in South Carolina, we would have blew you out. But it wasn't. We want. We still won the LSU. But you cannot win a national championship playing six and a half players. And I say six and a half because the other one's only half, and the other one will only come in when somebody's in foul trouble. You can't do it. You are an injury away from being irrelevant. One injury. One injury away from being irrelevant. If there's an injury to, injury, injury to Angel Reese, if there's an injury to Fly J is y'all best defender. Matter of fact, if there's the, who the most valuable player on LSU, not the best player, the most valuable player on LSU is Flaje Johnson because she plays defense. That's y'all most va valuable player. If Flaje was to get hurt and be out an extended amount of time, y'all in trouble. Trouble. Angel Reese got Camilla a couple times. She did. Block the shot. Camilla pulled it down. She blocked the shot. I got it. Anissa Morrow can score. I got it. Michaela Williams finds way to score. Flaje plays defense. She is y'all best all around player. Not best offensively, but for sure by a country dirt road defensively. If you want to compete with South Carolina, you have to recruit. You have to recruit and trust your players. You have to trust your players. You have to. That is what you have to do. You have to do it, y'all. We got so many comments. I know some of y'all got to go to work. I don't have to go to work tomorrow. So I can go on as long as y'all want me to go on. But um, I appreciate all the love. I, I, I mean, I do. I really do. I am texting my wife, telling her to order some food. Because uh, I'm hungry. I don't know who else is hungry. I ain't. I, I, the pig feet thing is done. I, I ain't need no more pig feet. They're gonna tear my stomach up. Um, let me see, Carl, uh, Miss Kalia. They miss key free throws as usual. Miss Kalia, come on. Now we've been shooting. This is the thing, right? The first, the first five games in SEC play, we were shooting seventy nine percent from the free throw line. Tonight we were not. We missed some key free throws, and um, we had a bad night shooting the three ball. I mean the free throw line. We did. But the previous five games of SEC play, we were locked in at the free throw line. Tonight, we weren't. Tonight, we weren't. Well, Ms. Kelly, I thank you for the comment, though. I really do. Rhonda Wright, Tessa is the real deal, too. Yes, she is. Now, now, Tessa played in a little spurt tonight. I think, so this is, this is, this is what it is, right? And I told y'all, I told y'all before, I mentioned that when games really matter, the bench will shrink some. The bench will shrink some, and Don is going to play the players that she really trusts. And she showed that in the second half. She played the players that she really trusts in those big moments. Pow Pow's a senior, all Pac-12, multiple times, shoot that rock, consistent. Bree Hall is a junior, 
consistent. You know, uh, Raven is doing that work and showing that she is one of the best point guards out there. You know, she, Raven's not going to shoot 25, get 25 points and, and, and get all this. No, no, that's what she don't. But would you know, would you have a Raven Johnson? Raven Johnson directs that offense. She wreck that offense. You can see it on her face. You can see her in her movements, how she's getting people into place and how she get pissed off when players don't get in the right position. That's what rape. That's what I want in a point guard. That is what I want from a point guard. I don't want my point guard shooting 30 times in a damn game. I don't want that. I want my point guard directing traffic and being the quarterback of my offense. That's what I want my point guard to do. Direct the offense, get everybody in their position, pass the ball when need to, take over the game when you need to, but be that floor general of that offense. I get sick and tired, sick and tired of seeing these um, lists that show point guards who ain't point guards. I'm sick of that. Raven Johnson is the quintessential point guard for your basketball team. She will guard you. She will disrupt you. She will get everyone in position. And here's a, here's a good one. She will lead the team. How about that? And you can lead the team in multiple different ways. But for my taste, for my taste of what Captain Will wants, I want my point guard directing traffic on offense, not shooting a whole bunch of shots. That's not a point guard. That's a shooting guard. They have a whole different name for that. It's called a shooting guard. Mm. Ronda Wright. Uh, no, I was just asking your uh, Mecca baby. Uh, has anyone seen all the soft, all the teams soccer I play? Most of them are not good teams. <laughs> Bra. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. Darrell Walker's guy already came back before I say something. Becca, what part in the season did you start watching? South Carolina's played ranked teams from game one. I have no idea. See, this is the thing. You have like um you have fans. You have fans who are a fan of their team, but not a fan of women's basketball. There's difference. There's a difference. If you're a fan of your team, if you're a fan of your team, that's fine. That is great. You 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 rock with the, your team, your, and, and, and you watch when they play and all this, that. But if you're a fan of women's basketball, you know about other teams as well. So apparently, I don't think you're a fan of women's basketball. I could be wrong, but a statement like that, it, 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 it don't it, it makes me sound it makes me think that you're not a fan of women's basketball because South Carolina is number one for a reason. South Carolina has played eight teams in the top 50. South Carolina is now eight and oh against teams in the top 50. South Carolina has the 19th ranked strength of schedule. So please do not compare schedules of South Carolina and LSU. LSU, going into this game, had the 109th strength of schedule. So the question is, who has LSU played? Not the question that who has South Carolina played. So when the strength of schedules come out tomorrow, it's going to show the LSU strength of schedule has improved because they played South Carolina. That's it, brother or sister. That's what it is. Carolina plays top teams. LSU don't play top teams. They play Colorado. They play Virginia Tech. And now they play South Carolina. Of those top teams, they are one and two. They got beat up by Colorado and they lost against us. And then they lost against Auburn. Bro. About time to hit another shot. Thank you, baby. Order some McDonald's for your boy. And it's not a shout out to McDonald's because McDonald's is not rocking with your man, Captain Will. I think we need to start 
a, a, a whole promotion. Because I've been giving McDonald's uh, service since I was a youngster. You know, so they need to rock with Captain Will. Country Notary, y'all hit that like button. Country Notary, thank you for calling too, sis. Thank you for calling. LK Life, you are so right, Captain Will. Our girls don't make excuses. We just learn every from every game. Don is still so classy. She is awesome. I don't know what young lady in the country who is playing basketball, who aspire to be a not only a Division I basketball player, but who aspire to play in the W. I don't know of a player why they wouldn't choose South Carolina. I have no idea. I have no idea. South Carolina will always challenge for a championship. We may not win every one, but we will always challenge for a championship. We will always challenge for an SEC championship, national championship. South Carolina will always be coached by the GOAT. And I, I, don't, I don't throw that word around lightly because there are other college coaches or other coaches in the NBA, in, co in high school, college, everything, who have a resume like Don Staley. They are. They are, they are, they are coaches comparable. Don Staley won two championships. Ken Mulkey has won more. But I call Don Staley the GOAT because... Don Staley is a Hall of Fame player, a Hall of Fame coach. Don Staley won a gold medal as a player and as a coach. Who else? Who else? That's why I say she's the GOAT. They are great coaches, but I don't I don't know why uh, why kids. Uh, I have my 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 um. I have my thoughts. I have my thoughts. I ain't gonna lie. I have my thoughts about it because you're not promised anything when you come to South Carolina. You're not promised anything. You're not start. You're not promised a starting position. You're not promised minutes. You're not promised. Everybody got to work. Everybody got to work. And that concept of everybody got to work works at South Carolina because you have to be bought in to that some players are not bought into that some players want to go to a place where they're going to play 30 35 minutes yeah i understand i understand some players don't want to sit the bench we have players that transfer out because they don't want to sit the bench they don't want to trust the process and learn and grow because everybody on south carolina has uh, were highly recruited everybody on south carolina was 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 uh highly ranked in their respective classes so it's not a situation where I'm the I'm the highest ranked player that's ever been at South Carolina. No. No, it's not that situation where you're the highest ranked player in South Carolina because we've had AJ Wilson is the gold standard. And everything come falls short below AJ Wilson. So you have to wait your turn. You have to wait your turn. Raven Johnson had to wait a turn. Bree Hall Wait our turn. Cardoza, wait our turn. Sanaya, everybody have to wait their turn because everybody is good. George Edwards showing up next year. Adele Tack is already there. Maddie McDaniel will be on campus this summer. I mean, come on. And there's no starting roles that are given. George Edwards is the pride and joy of of the country right now number two ranked player number one ranked player whatever uh uh, uh metric you want to use for joyce edwards captain wheels metric she's number one ranked player in the country okay from camden right down the street right down the street from columbia you can go to any any school in the country and start and play 30 35 minutes she chose to go to south carolina where she has to work manny mcdaniel putting in work PG County in Maryland. She knows she's going to have to sit and learn, but that's going to make her better, y'all. You get better on the South Carolina team because you are practicing against some of the best players in the country. Some of the best players in the country. You know how much Maddie's going to grow from playing with, uh, with, with, with Raven Johnson, playing with Bree Hall, 
Malaysia Fool Wally, possibly Tahina Pow Pow. You know how much she's going to grow as a basketball player? Immensely. You know how Joyce is going to grow playing with, with Fagan and Chloe? Her and Chloe are tight. Just get better and better. So you have players that go to other places, and you have players that decide that they don't want to come to South Carolina for whatever reason. But you just watch. You just watch all these players, all these players who have the opportunity to play for South Carolina and they decide, nah, I got a better situation here. Oh, I got a better situation there. We see you. We will see you. We will see you. And when we see you, you'll be getting that L against the best team in the country. But you begin your playing time, though. You will begin your playing time. You will. Um, Amy KK, why do you think Lay, Lay didn't play much in the second half? I think that she didn't play much because Don trusted more of the veterans. I think I think that's the reason. I think uh, Lay, 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 Lay is a spark plug. She is an energizer bunny. She is a ex extremely talented player. Extremely talented player. And she will begin those minutes when the game matters. And she saved us in the second quarter. She did. But I think in the second half, she trusted the combination of Breezy, Raven, and Pow Pow. And she rode that train. Um, Don said Aaliyah said something to Bree at the halftime that seemed to calm her down. Hmm. That's from Day T. What's up? What's up, girl? Hey, um, I mean, that's 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 leadership. That's leadership, you know. And and, and Bree is so special, but you never know what's going on in these girls' minds. Because you know, this is the thing. This is the thing that we always gotta remember. These are somebody's babies. These are somebody's babies, and they are thrust into a situation where they are under immense pressure, immense pressure. And you got everybody talking about them. You got everybody talking about them. You got, you know, you have the media, you have fans, you have uh, people on social media who who are mean and, and, and derogatory, which you'll never hear from Captain Will. I'm talking derogatory about any girl. I will never talk derogatory about any girl who plays for us or against us because that ain't my thing because I got girls. I got girls. And somebody talking about my girls, I'm going to get crunk. So I know how that is with, with, uh, with uh, the parents and their kids. Very protective. Very protective. Now, I'm very protective about my girls on this team. So, so you know, we ain't going to do none of that. But you, these girls are going through stuff. And mental, mental health is real. Mental health is real. We got to keep these girls in a the, in the great place, in a safe place, because everything is, is just so important, y'all. It's so important. Now, mental health is real because I know I'm a product of mental health. I got PTSD. I know that. Take medication every day. That's what I do. Kiss me leveled out. I saw some stuff, you know, in the military, you know? So it, it just, you know, mental health is real. So we pray for these girls, stay strong. And, and, and this is the thing. Our girls are never in trouble, ever, ever in trouble. And they ain't, they ain't in trouble. You ain't gonna hear about it. You ain't gonna hear about it. Because Don Staley takes care of that business. You never the stuff that was going on with LSU early in the season that would never happen with South Carolina, that that would never happen with South Carolina. We would never know as a team that that ever happened, ever happened, because everything would be kept in house. Because everybody don't need to know everybody's business. Everybody need to know. You should correct it at home, correct it in the correct it in the um the practice, and keep moving. And then next day it's over. It's over. Remember that that situation, that game where Raven and Stark? Remember that? Yeah. Everything kept in house, man. Uh, Molly Benenti uh, won this game. Molly is so awesome. Molly is so awesome. And, and this is the thing you got to watch with Molly. This is the thing you got to watch with Molly. Who's to say? And I, I, I'm not putting this in the atmosphere, but I just got to say it. Molly's special. Molly's special. So, so our coaching staff is special. We had a coach, Coach Shamel, 
got a head coaching gig, Bowling Green. Everybody's talking about Molly. Molly got a whole brand now. We better keep Molly. That's what we better do. We better keep Molly because I can see Molly being her on an NBA team, a NFL team, in whatever aspect, a UFC, whatever. Because she, it works. Whatever she doing. Because I ain't signed up yet. But I'm still trying to drop these LBs while I order a burger. Um, but it's working. It's working. So we better. And, and, see, and I, I didn't even see your message. CG Jr. Molly needs a raise for sure. She sure do. She do. We cannot let Molly leave USC. Nope. There is no way. No way that Molly can leave USC. She has to stay at USC. Carl Dean, the game was great for women's basketball. It sure was. The game was amazing. I can't wait to see the ratings tomorrow to see what this game did. But it is growth for the sport. And we need more of this on ESPN, Fox, CBS, whatever, FS1, all these different outlets. We need that. We need that. Ladies and gentlemen, we are an hour and a half in, and I don't have any more alcohol. Sad. I got a sweet. Mm. And again, this is a spot where I say subscribe, 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 wherever you get your podcast, uh, out iTunes. Uh, is it iTunes, Apple Podcasts, Our Heart Radio, mm, Spotify, all of them everywhere you get a, a podcast. Find your boy Captain Will. We are growing. We are our numbers are going up on that platform. And I just started this like two weeks ago, so our numbers are going up with that. And and hit the subscribe button for you know for this show and see more of me. Uh, Twitter or X, whatever they call it now, Gamecocks Talk, and um, and on Instagram, Instagram, Gamecocks Talk with Captain Will. Hit me up, DM me. I try to get to as many messages as I can. I really do. Try to get as many messages as I can. Um, so many questions, so many. We have 977 new comments. 977 new comments. You know what I mean? That means that our growth of this program is growing and growing and growing. And I love the dialogue. Love the dialogue. Um, Tony Belt, enjoy your show and the content. Keep it going, Captain Will. Go game cost. And we're going to appreciate it, Tony. I appreciate the love, too. We're going to do this more often. We're going to do this more in the call-in shows. And, and I, I get better with it. I don't have a producer. I'm just in my office chopping it up with y'all, you know. Um, we'll get better with this and it'll continue to grow. You know, my wife is feeding me the messages and everything. So the comments and stuff. So this is a one-stop shop, but we'll get better. We will get better. Um, but I appreciate everything. Leon Broker, South Carolina has to be more physical in the paint because they really got outplayed in the area. The first half for sure. The first half for sure. Uh, LSU was the more physical team. LSU were hustling more. We were out hustling in the first half. And uh, like my man Baylor said, Darnell said, um, I think they was kind of feeding off the crowd, feeding off the adrenaline. But once you get that adrenaline dump, and that's in any sport, you have this adrenaline dump and you be you just feel down. You feel down. And we saw that in the legs. We saw that in the legs. Thank you, babe. We saw it in the legs. And um, Angel Reese started cramping up. We saw it in the legs. We saw Anissa Morrow getting tired on defense. We saw all those things. Mm. Uh, Pino Grigio. If you're not on wine, you need to be. I'm, I'm not advocating, you know, alcohol. You know, if you're a drinker. Pino Grigio. I love it. I love it. Um, Mocha Latte, I'll definitely be rewatching this game. I'll be watching it too. I'll be rewatching this game. I, I rewatch every game, but I, I have to rewatch this game, especially. Especially. It is it just, it just, um, 
Now, I want to see it repeated over and over again like they do on some other games. CG Jr., I'm really nice. The whiskey was flowing during the game. <laughs> LOL. We don't. We didn't play our best at all tonight. We didn't play the best at all. Uh, but because these women refuse to lose, you, you got to have the mentality too, right? You got to refuse to lose type mentality. They were able to win the game, but this was not a uh, not a good game for us. I think we play. I think we played. I think we played okay. And we play really good in spurts. In spurts. I think we play much better against Vanderbilt. But LSU got something to do with that too. LSU play good ball. LSU is a good team. They play good ball. So we got to give them credit too. They play well. They play well. So we're just a better team. Top to bottom. Top to bottom, we're just a better team. Um, Sanaya Fagan came to play also. Sanaya Fagan, in, in SEC play, Sanaya Fagan has been balling. She's been balling. She's been balling. The, the light switch has been flipped on. She has been balling. And I, I am so happy, so happy for her. So happy to have Sanaya Fagan back with confidence, with confidence. And she was, she was D'ing up Angel Reese. They was bodying down low. And the refs was confused about what should we should call as a foul and not a foul. So we we can talk about that. But I, I love this version of Sanaya Fagan. Y'all gotta we, we, we just gotta understand Sanaya Fagan six foot three. Sanaya Fagan six foot three. I'm about let me see how tall I am. I would say I'm about five eleven three quarters. That's that's specific, huh? I was like, but you know, that's a military because we always weigh, I mean you always do the height. Without the shoes on. So I say I'm about 6 1 with shoes on, with J's on. 6 1 with J's on. And at the Under Armour 24, where, you know, Fagan was there, Raven was there, and, you know, there was helping the, the, the elite athletes, which I cannot wait to go back to ATL for this event next year or this year. It's this year, 2024. But if I'm looking up to somebody, they tall. They tall. And I look up to Sonia Fagan. She's tall. And she's strong. I think Sonia Fagan is going to continue to play well this year, and I think she's going to ball out next year. Her senior season is going to be good. And I think she's waiting her time, and I think she's time for her. Robert Arrington. Hey, Captain Will, how are you? Robert, I appreciate all the love, man. I appreciate all the love. appreciate all the comments. You are a faithful, pay, faithful consumer of Captain Will. I, I really do. Consumer, faithful customer. Let's go with that one. I like that better. Of Captain Will. James McFadden, Sarah Strong, you really need to come to Columbia. You know Sarah Strong was watching this game tonight. You know she was watching this game tonight. She saw the hype. She saw the hoopla. She saw, I mean, Simone Augustus was, was there at the game. Simone Augustus, LSU legend, WNBA legend, Hall of Famer, all these different things at the game. But you know what you also saw? You saw a team play tonight. And that team is South Carolina. She hasn't chosen who she's going to go to yet. She hasn't chosen. Could this be a game? We have we really have to get her on the campus. We have to get Sarah Strong on the campus for an official visit before she makes that choice of where she's going to school. I think that um the relationship that she has with Joyce Edwards will help. I think that another thing that don't be um can't be understated too. You know, they'd be playing together in the McDonald's All American game. They were at the Under Armour Elite, they played together or uh, against each other. For a long time. Sarah Strong, if she chooses South Carolina, I don't know where the championship is in 2025, but you're going to book your stuff right now. Going to book it. Shaquem, I love you, Cap. Hey, same, same. I love everybody. Love everybody. And I love that this is growing. I love that this is amazing for women's basketball, women's sports. Latoya Libran. It's definitely different because Don is bringing AU to, to NCAA for women. Hmm. Say that again. Bringing AU to NCAA for women. That's a good point. FBC United. FBC United. Raven Johnson. Malaysia Fulwiley. Joyce Edwards. Camila Cardoza and Raven play AU together. Is it, it, FBC United is almost a doggone uh, 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 filter, a, a development league for South Carolina. 
Relationships matter, y'all. Relationships matter. And I love every second of it. Love every second of it. Daryl Walkins, I yelled at my TV tonight, but I was so proud of the team in the end. This team is young, but they show they have heart tonight more than the Utah game. Utah game, we growed. We grew. We got better. We learned from it. North Carolina game. North Carolina game, we learned from that game. Dude, this is a constant learning experience for a young basketball team tonight they passed the test in a hostile environment against a really good basketball team and we won the basketball game by six points seven points eight points whatever the, the score would have been we won the basketball game the girls are going to sleep well tonight because they know they beat a they, they just beat the national champions now i know the national champions is a different different team different team you know, but they have the ring. It's still got Angel Reese. Still got Flaje. You know, but it's, it's a different team than it was last year. I got it. I got it. But supposedly, this is supposed to be a better team than last year. Supposedly. Where they're going to drop in the polls, AP poll, I can care less because AP poll sucks to me. You know, that number nine team, whatever. I don't, I don't. You, if you a follower of Captain Will, you already know. I don't care. Uh, I don't care at all about the AP poll. Don't care at all. The poll that matters to me is the net rankings. That's what matters to me. AP poll, I don't care. They can be whatever. Doesn't make blah, blah, blah. I want to take into account offensive rating, defensive rating, where the game actually played. So South Carolina tomorrow will get extra points in their net ranking because the game was played in LSU against a number 11th ranked team in that ranking. Scoring margins, strength of schedule, all those things matter in net ranking. None of that stuff matters in AP poll. None of it. Only thing that matters in AP poll, you want a loss. So in AP poll, when it comes out on, on Monday afternoon, it'll show the LSU probably drop the 12th or something. I'm here to say LSU is not the 12th best team in the country. LSU is a really good basketball team. They are not 12. They just lost against South Carolina. And they, they, they lost that game against Auburn, but they're a good basketball team. They're a good basketball team. It really is. All right, fam. I think that we're going to do, I think it now, I think we established this now. Every time I do a live show, we are going to do a call-in show. I think I think it's amazing. I think because I love talking to the fans. Now we I don't know how many calls because I got a lot of miss missed calls, but we'll do the live call-in show on Sunday after the game against Vanderbilt. So we will do that probably starting at five. Game is at three, so probably around five. We do the live call-in show. Chopping it up all about Vanderbilt because it is on to the next game. It's on to the next game. We're on to the next game. We still got 377 people. Those 377 people, thank you for rocking with your boy, Captain Will, tonight. I love y'all. Thank you so much. We had a great day. We had a great evening. We ate some pig feet. We drank some sweet tea. We did everything that we said that we were going to do. And that was BLSU. And have a good time tonight. You are now rocking with the best. And since you're rocking with the best, come rock with your man, Captain Will. Let's go. Let's go.